Right now at six, an armed and very dangerous man out there tonight. Police say he tried to kidnap two women this morning who were out running in Charlotte. Here's what happened. A car pulls up on York Road near Lake Wiley. The driver points gun at a runner and demands she gets in. The jogger gets away. An hour later, the same suspect approaches another jogger nine miles away from the first incident. Again, the man points a gun, tells her to get into the car, and once again, the jogger gets away. Now, after both 911 calls, police responded in full force, eventually finding the suspect's car in West Charlotte. We do have team coverage for you tonight. NBC Charlotte's Brandon Goldner with reaction from families living in the area. But first, we want to get out to Tanya Mendez with the very latest on the search for the suspect. Tanya? Well, we're standing at the very spot where police were able to find that suspect's car. It was right in the woods behind me. It had been burned out. No sign of that suspect, though. Police have spent much of the day chasing down leads, hoping to track that guy as soon as possible. CMPD officers with big guns and loud sirens roll up. It's kind of scary. Right by Melanie Farnwalt's hot dog stand. And here we sit. I'm like, what would I do? Police telling everyone to be on the lookout after a man in a Mercedes pulled a gun on two female joggers this morning. It was an obvious attempt to, to force them to get into the car at gunpoint. The two abduction attempts happening a few miles and minutes apart. The first, a woman jogging right by an elementary school near the Charlotte Premium Outlets. The second, a woman on a morning run on Dixie River Road, identical M.O. Hispanic male in a tan Mercedes stopped, pointed a gun at her, demanded she get in the car. Both women got away. Police brought in resources from all areas. Got a handful of troopers down here at the way station that uh, I know they were very eager to start pushing up into the woods. Officers found the car, which was stolen, hidden and burned in the woods near the Whitewater Center. Got a tip the suspect could be hiding out in the trails nearby. And the cops came up and said, run, get out of here. The Whitewater Center trail shut down for hours. I saw police on motorcycles coming out of the woods. Joggers now worried the suspect could be desperate. It scares me. I run a lot. Yeah. I run a lot, mostly by myself. Police worried too. This suspect is considered armed and dangerous. This woman trying to make a living. Oh, where is he? Wants him caught. I told her, I said, just run. Don't worry about me. Run. Yeah. So we're keeping a lookout. That's what those two joggers did. They ran. Police said they did the right thing. If somebody approaches you with a gun, tries to get you in the car, take off. Do not get in the car under any circumstances. The description is vague. We will give it to you, though. Hispanic male, light skin, dark, straight hair in his 20s or 30s. Reporting live, I'm Tanya Mendes, NBC Charlotte. Tanya, thank you.